Hey guys, how we doing? It's me, Glory, and I'm coming to you today with card number eight of my Christmas cards, guys. So I hope everyone's doing really good. So let's get started. Today I am using this paper pack from Recollections. It's called Botanical Noel, and it got some really, really gorgeous papers in it. And you can turn some into tags, into uh, card bases in the front. Look at how beautiful this is. Oh my god, this paper is so gorgeous. And when I bought it last year, I think it was last year, it was already after the season. So today I am using this paper right here. And this paper is super gorgeous too and blingy. So let's get started. My card base is going to be an A2 size card. And instead of me doing it a top fold card, which it will be like this, I'm going to do it on the side. And it's going to open this way. So let's get started. I have my layers. So I have my red cardstock, then this light gray cardstock that I got. And I end up using the stamps for the flourishes from uh, Inky Dicky Do. And this one is called uh, Figury Snowman. And I just use this snow, I mean not that one, I use this one right here. And I did a little design on the edges. Then I also cut out a one and a quarter inch strip and I end up using some scotch uh, glitter tape. And I end up putting a red trim in the middle and I'm just going to adhere this in the bottom. So let me put all of this together. So guys, are y'all still eating turkey? I'm not, but I still got plenty of turkey left over. And, you know, I was just trying to come up with different ways of um, what else I could make. And one of my co-workers, it was the, the, the best thing ever. One of my co-workers was talking about how about a turkey pot pie instead of chicken pot pie, put turkey in it. I says, you know, that would be awesome. I will be doing that. So I can't wait till I can make that but i'm not rushing it because i'm already turkey doubt so now i want to put this layer of this band in between and making sure that it's like centered in the middle because i want it to be in the middle of all both of the designs the same way and i think that looks good right there okay Yes, and now I'm just going to add some ATG to this side, and I'm going to add it to the card base. And then I end up using a cut from Elegant Edges, and I use, um, I'm not even sure the name of it. Let me see if I can find out the name. Um, the name of this is called Flourish Design Label. And then I'm just going to add this to the middle. And I have this pearlized uh, cardstock. And it matches perfect. And now here goes my label. So here goes the label of the shadow and then the top label. And I kind it kind of I kind of messed up on the stamping, but then I looked at it and I said no I didn't because sometimes a lot of the words they like faded a little bit. So that's what and I says, you know, I'm just going to keep it like that. And I thought it was pretty cool. So I got these two layers and I cut this out at three and a half by 2.75 guys. Okay. So I am just going to adhere this to the back. And I would have thought about putting this on some foam tape, but this is going on the inside of the card. So it wouldn't do no good for it. So now I'm just going to have my piece right there. Make sure it's centered. And okay. Voila. Now. I have. My image. That I'm going to put right in the middle. And it's going to go in the middle of this. Let me kind of line this up straight. So I know exactly where the middle is at. And. I want it to be the same width, and that looks good. I just got to kind of dangle the sentiment a little bit, and that sounds good. And there goes the inside of the card, guys. And for my sentiment there, 
I end up using this really, really, really old stamp set that I got off of a customer a couple, I mean, years back. And, um, it says, wishing you a happy holiday season and a wonderful new year. And I thought it was perfect for this. So there goes the inside of my card, guys. So now let's start decorating the front of the card. Now for the front of the card, I have... My red cardstock and my patent paper. And look at how gorgeous this is. And especially it says, Merry Christmas, Believe, Winter. Oh my God, it is so gorgeous, guys. So now I'm just going to take this and I'm going to adhere it together. And I'm just going to put it on the top of my card base. And then we're going to show you what else I did. And I end up using one, two, three files. And they were really simple. And what I did was take one a cut from one other file to use it on this file. Because I couldn't find the right uh, banner. And I thought this banner was perfect for it. And it fitted just fine. So I just cut that one out. So here goes the front of the card. And I'm just going to adhere this down. Perfect looking just like that guys and it's gonna open up to saying like that so now I end up cutting out the word joy Out of the holiday through the years iron on cartridge, okay? And what I ended up doing was I cut these out, but I didn't cut the circle out I mean not the circle. I didn't cut the O out because I wanted the O to be a reef so I cut the letters out what size did I cut the letters out? I cut the letters out at one and a half inches wide. Well, this was one and a half inches wide. I can't fit. The whole entire design is 2.9. So you could put it at three inches tall. So I have that right there. So now what I want to do is adhere these. But I want to get my straight ruler, so let me see if this would work for me. Because lately I've been having a problem making things straight. Okay, so it's going to look just like that. And I might want it to go just a little bit more. And I got this a long time ago and I never, never used it. This was like an add-on to an uh, order that I had. I didn't have enough. To put in my cart to get, I, I guess it was like free shipping. So I ended up putting this in. And this was only a couple of dollars. Okay, so I think I'm going to put the words right there. Let me see. If I put the words right there. No, I got to come down a little bit more. Because it's not even enough. And I think that looks much even. Right there. Okay, so now what I'm going to do. I'm going to take. I got this on foam tape. So I'm going to take the backing off and I'm going to adhere it straight in the corner. And it's going to look just like this. And that looks straight. And then I'm going to do the same thing with the Y, putting it close to the edge because I have everything all measured out the way I need it to be on my card. So now, I'm going to take the Y, I'm going to line it down on the bottom, just like that, and that looks good. Okay, so now I could get rid of this and press down on this, okay? So there goes the J and the Y. Now, for my reef, I end up getting this reef out of the Anna Winter went to cartridge and I cut this out at two and a half by two point three fourths and here goes my <laughs> I love it I love it I love it here goes my reef and I got the bow popped up and I'm gonna have this right in the middle just like that so now I'm just gonna put some wet glue on this And I'm just going to put this right down in the bottom. Well, not in the bottom, but in the middle. 
lining up let me move this back over here because I want it to be even and straight okay and then lining the bottom up with the reef and making sure it's pointed straight looking right at you and there it goes guys so there goes that part okay that looks so good guys now the next thing is i end up cutting out a banner from the teresa collins october 25th and it's a banner reef but i cut this banner off and it came from another reef but i didn't like the reef how it looked so i thought this one was better but i liked it, this banner and i stamped inside i believe and i got the i believe from the micro uh scrappy mom stamp set and it's called winter wishes and it's i believe and then i have that on foam tape so i'm just going to take this off and i'm going to center this right there and that looks good and it says joy i believe wishing you a happy holiday season and a wonderful new year i really hope you like my card number eight thank you guys so much for watching i so do appreciate your support if you like this video please thumbs it up leave a comment let me know what you think about this card and until next time i'll see you until I come back with card number nine, I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye now. This looks so crooked. Okay. That's the front. And this is the inside. I love this glitter tape. I got this glitter tape from a, a bargain store for 25 cents, guys. And I picked all of them up that they had. They called uh, washi tape expressions. 25 cents. They were selling these for $3. Okay, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Oh, and I also want to thank all of you that said that you like my hair. I just finally got it cut down again, and I really like it too, guys. So thank you so much for all those kind comments that y'all left letting me know that I'm beautiful. I so do appreciate that, but you know, that's only in the eye of the beholder. But thank you, guys, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.